The community and students gather once a week to celebrate different cultures with film and food. The film series is put together by Director of International Studies John Singleton. His decision to focus on Guatemala was partially influenced by his personal ties to the culture. I happen to know a, a, a little bit more about that uh, about that country. So, uh, so some some Guatemalan writers that live in another part of the U.S. had uh, contacted me when they were having this festival and asked if I was interested in bringing any of them here. Director of Las Marimbas del Infierno, Juli, Julio Hernandez Cordon, used his fictional documentary to display Guatemalan culture with a touch of humor. This movie is a mix with fiction and documentary. And also it's like a, a joke. For Guatemala student Melu Guillen, the film series brought some comfort as she was reminded of her native culture. This is the first time I see a Guatemalan movie in this film series and I was like, yay, Guatemalan, because whenever I see something about Guatemala, I feel happy about it. For other students, the film showed an honest portrayal of a foreign culture. For example, the main character was getting, like he had an extortion case about himself and how they have to survive and all the difficulties that's there, and that's not really projected in the normal pictures. It's for the same honest view of Guatemalan culture that Singleton chose this director. What, was, what I felt was really strong about this film was it was really a very, sort of a gentle film, but at the same time a very tough film about day-to-day uh, -day experience in a, in a place that very few people go, which is, you know, the barrios of Guatemala. Guillen also approved of the film's portrayal of Guatemalan culture. I think it did a good job. There's always, like, different sides of a culture, and I've seen this side before. The film series will continue to highlight different cultures throughout the year. Crystal Galvan, TCU News Now.